folly inspired look um so yeah really that's it uh, if you want to learn how to get this look then just keep watching okay so this is going to be video number two that i've made um the first one that i didn't like i did post pictures of it but i didn't like it so i'm just gonna get started jump right in because my baby is asleep she hasn't been sleeping that long, so I gotta do this fast. <laughs> Hopefully it comes out good. The first thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and moisturize my lips with the chapstick. This is a candy cane. And my hair's a mess right now because I don't have it up, but I'm not done fixing around my face. I'm using the Clinique Dramatically Different Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion. This is my favorite. And right now, after I Ever since I've had my baby, I have a really dry skin like around this area right here and on my nose, like on the sides of my nose, on the tops. And if you can see my background, ignore it because it's a mess. I need, what the heck, I don't know where that came from, but it is a mess, so yeah, I'll just ignore that. The next thing I'm going to use is the Professional <coughs> by Benefit. And I like to put this all over my face because I feel like it just smooths out my whole entire face. Um, and I like to do all of this first so all of this can kind of just like set in to my face while I'm doing like other, other stuff. Okay, so I'm going to do my eyebrows and uh, prime my eyelids off camera. Um, what I'm going to use for my eyebrows is the Anastasia Dip Brow in uh, medium brown and the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion in Eden. Um, and then I'll be right Okay, so I'm done with my eyebrows and my eyes. I forgot to mention that I also set my eyeshadow primer with the uh, Rimmel London Stay Matte um, Pressed Powder. Okay, so next we'll move on to the eyeshadow. So we're going to use the Norvina palette by Anastasia. I've already <laughs> dipped into it a couple of times so far. I really love this palette. So the first color I'm going to go ahead and start with is going to be um, Eccentric. E Eccentric. Yes, that sounds weird to me. I don't know. Which is this color right here. And this is going to go in the crease. I'm just going to buff this out until I am satisfied and then keep adding color in also until I'm satisfied with the pigmentation of this color. So I'm just going in windshield wiper motions and in circular motions also. Um, the next color I'm going to go in with is going to be Incense, I think, Incense, which is this color right here. And this is going to go in my crease also, but not as high as the, as eccentric. I'm not getting a whole bunch of incense because I don't want too much of it. I just want to smoke this out just a little, but not a whole bunch. I'm just going to use the Instant Age Rewind Concealer. Um, this is by Maybelline. And
And then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go in with base right here. Um, and I'm just gonna pack that on and I'm gonna set the concealer. And now I'm gonna go back in with eccentric and I'm gonna add this to the corners with the same brush I'm gonna go in with incense and I'm gonna use the other end of that brush and blend that out I'm gonna go in with the NYX Glitter Primer. I'm gonna put this on this little flat brush right here. I'm just gonna let a little bit out and I'm gonna kinda dab this on there. And I'm just gonna go in line. Find a line. And then I'm gonna go in with Dreamer and I'm gonna dip that brush in there. And I'm gonna follow that line that I made. So I'm just going to do this to this side also. And I'm going to go back in with the base on here. And kind of line. that up okay so the next thing I'm gonna do is use the NYX dark circle um, concealer it's a corrector I'm just gonna put this right here and then I'll put some more on my lip too um, it says for your eyes or not for your eyes it just says it's a concealer dark circle concealer actually so it does say it's for your eyes but I go ahead and put it around my uh, mouth sometimes because I'm dark right there I'm going to use the dewy and smooth foundation by fit me and I'm in 120 classic ivory So I'm going to go in with my MAC uh, liquid eyeliner. I'm just going to eye my eyeliner, my eyeliner, my eyelids. Okay, so now I already have it open. I'm gonna go in with the uh, Maybelline New York Instant Age Rewind Concealer. So I just do it under my eyes, my chin, above my lip, my nose, and my forehead. Okay, so 
Now I'm going to go in and set my under eyes with the uh, Laura Mercier translucent powder. Okay, I'm just making sure all my creases are gone. I'm getting into where I would have creases, which is like right here on my nose. And then I'm just going to set in the middle of my nose for when I do my contour and just right here in the middle of my forehead. Uh, let's see. So while that's setting, we'll go into our eyelashes. And the lashes I'm going to use is the um, Salon Perfect 615s. These are one of my favorite lashes. They're like really dramatic, but they will go with any look. I think they will. Okay, so I'm going to let those dry. And I'm going to go in with the uh, Fit Me Matte and Poreless Powder. And I'm going to use this to set the rest of my face. We'll go ahead and move back to my eyes and um, we'll do the bottom lash line. I'm going to go in with Eccentric and I'm going to blend it down. And then I'm going to go in with Incense. And I'm putting that one way closer to my lash line. Okay, I'm going to go in with a darker color. I'm going to go in with volat Volatile, vol whatever the fuck that word is, but it's this color right here. Oh yeah, that one's better. Darkened it up a lot. It's like a chocolate brown. Oh, light chocolate brown. Oh my god, I just put my ball. I'm gonna go into the Nicole Guerrero, Nicole, the Nicole Guerrero um, Glow Kit, and I'm just gonna go in with um, Forever Young, which is this color right here, and go in my inner corner. And I'm gonna add this also to my brow the highlight. But I'm going to go in with the Shade and Light uh, Kat Von D palette and I'm going to use Subconscious right here to contour my face. I'm going to use this blush by uh, Revlon. It's called Wine Not. I think it's good for this fall. Whoa. I'm getting a little too excited with the blush. For this fall look that I'm doing. Jesus Christ. Sorry, guys. My blush. I'm going to go in and contour my nose. So I'm going to go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit again. And I'm going to use Forever Young again for my highlight. Jesus. Take the wheel. So now I'm just going to blend. I'm going to go ahead and set my face with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. So now I'm going to go ahead and go in with the uh, L'Oreal Voluminous uh, Mascara. This is in Black is Black. And I'm just going to get my lashes in with the other lashes 
and do my bottom lashes. Um, this is the NYX Lingerie Lipstick in French Made. So it's kind of like this mauve folly color. So I'm going to go through and do one more good blend. Okay, so this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial, and I'll see you next time. Bye.